This is a Fox 4 News breaking news report. I share the disappointment of many because we thought particularly along the streetcar line and adjacent to it that we addressed a number of our issues. Flooding in the Kansas City Crossroads District tonight. Dramatic flooding. A water main break may take a day or two to fix now. The KC streetcar had to shut down service for a little while tonight as we head into the holiday weekend. I'm Kevin Barry. I'm Lauren Halifax. The water main break happened near 17th and Main, but it's affecting Main Street all the way down to 20th. Fox 4 Shannon Russo has the latest on this breaking story tonight. Kevin Lauren, the good news here is that no one is hurt. No injuries have been reported because of this massive water main burst. However, it's unclear what if any structural damage has been done to nearby buildings. A sinkhole in downtown Kansas City swallowing a car on 17th and Main. The owner telling Fox 4 she parked here for an hour to go get drinks with friends. When she came back, she saw this. This disturbs us greatly. That's why everybody's here tonight. That's why we're working to address this as fast as possible. Kansas City firefighters first saw the water coming back from another scene around 615. The 30 inch break now needing emergency inspections. City manager Brian Platt says it could take up to two days to fix. It's a large main. It's a large hole. We're going to have to dig and excavate, pulling out the broken piece of pipe. We're not sure exactly what's going on under there yet. Fire crews also inspecting basements and other areas to make sure everyone is safe. Low water pressure is expected for a big portion of the city. Mayor Lucas says it'll impact 200,000 people from the Missouri River down to 63rd Street. We'll make sure first that we fix the current issue, but then beyond that, we'll try to make sure that our infrastructure downtown is as safe, stable, and solid as it can be anywhere. It's unclear what caused the pipe to burst. The weather is one thought since Kansas City experienced a 100 degree temperature difference in the span of a week. Infrastructure is another guess. The city spent the last decade replacing century old pipes below the city. We know that there are infrastructure challenges sometimes in a major city. We hate to see them, but we'll make sure not only that we address this concern, but make sure that we don't have other issues like this in the future. And right now, what's unclear just how much. Water was lost in that massive 30 inch break. The city says it will replace that pipe and then cap both ends. As for the people whose cars were impacted by all of this, the city claims it will do what it can to help them out. Live in downtown Kansas City this evening, Shannon Russo, Fox 4, working for you.